Hey girlfriends, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee Today and today I'm back with the hairstyle challenge and today's hairstyle challenge is kind of an old trend from like TikTok when everyone was using a sock or a robe tie to make heatless curls. Now that sounds silly for me because I already have curls so what I'm really trying to accomplish here but I'm trying to see if I can get like stretch out big loose like wavy curls versus my tight coils because you know I don't like for you to straighten your hair and use a curling one because that's just seems very counterproductive but I got the little invention from Amazon and I'm going to try it today so let's do a little unboxing first we get a headband two satin scrunchies and then the actual contraption and a clip it has little instructions how to use so this girl has bone straight hair. So first of all, we're very different. Uh, start with slightly damp hair. Lightly dampen the dry hair with a spray bottle or wet brush or drying your hair to slightly damp after shower. So here's the deal. Because we have very curly hair, we need to start off with it wet before it just dries in its naturally curly state. So my goal was to do this at 8 a.m. It's now 8 p.m. And I'm just filming this video, so my hair is already like drying without uh, any products. Why it looks a little frizzy because there's nothing in it. But let's get started. So I am going to dampen my hair, but at least my hair isn't soaking wet. Because for the videos that I have seen, I saw Lana Summer try this. I saw the Glam Bell try this. And both of them, like their hair took seven years to dry. And my, I know my hair also takes a long time to dry. So that made me nervous because I don't really want to sleep with this hairstyle like you're supposed to because I just feel like when I sleep on it's just going to get like undone and frizzy and looks uncomfortable to sleep in. So I'm going to try to do this hairstyle with a heated dryer or hooded dryer today. We gonna see. But I mean it is bedtime so I might just go to sleep. Alright so just dampening it again. If you saw my last video, I am trying the new brand called Bond Bar. This is to strengthen my hair. So I'm going to continue to use this for the rest of the year and see what it does on my hair. So I'm going to use their step number six, their bonding styling cream. And I'm going to kind of use it like as a leave-in before I do anything. But because I want there to be a little bit of hold, I feel like I should use a gel or mousse on top of this. And I'm gonna use this Tangle Teaser brush to kind of brush out my curls. Like so. A little bit more on this side. I think I'm gonna get a better middle part going on. Okay, grab my Tangle Teaser and I'm going to brush this out one more time. From the looks of it, it looks like I need a trim. That's what that tells me. So I'm gonna add a little more product on my ends. One time for the length check. Oh, wow. One time for the one time. Waist length. Wild. Come a long way. All right, back to the instructions. Fix the middle position of the curling roller with a hair clip on the top of your head. Okay, so here's my hair roller. This is literally just like a squishy piece of foam that's wrapped in satin. And I'm supposed to find the center. Let's make sure it's even. Like that, put it right at the top. And then we're supposed to clip it to our head. Like that. <laughs> we're looking cute already. Oh wait, I wanna add more mousse. Start over. I want to add a mousse because I think I need some hold. I'm going to use the Not Your Mother's Curl Talk Curl Activating Mousse to hopefully give me some more hold. Oh! I haven't used this in a while. <laughs> Darn it. Hopefully this doesn't activate my curls now that I said that. <laughs> I just want you for the hold. And I feel like a mousse is like a light enough option. I don't know. Let me know if you've tried this before. Let me know if you've tried it with like a gel. Okay, this might be a bad idea. This might make my curls pop in because it usually does, but. Okay, 
now we can go back to this, find the middle, put it here, and clip it. Then apparently we're supposed to start braiding the hair from one side and wind it around the curling roller. So I think you're supposed to take a, like a front piece like this. Let's make a smaller section. Grab the brush and we're gonna brush it around this thing, like so. And then you're supposed to grab more hair, okay, and then wrap it around. And I believe you want it to be as tight as possible since we're kind of trying to stretch out our curls. So you pull it and then I guess you grab some more. Okay, it's not too hard, but I did want to be brushing through, but now I need, you know. okay. <laughs> All right, there we go. So I pull it through, grab some more hair, and then I want to brush it. This brushing thing is not part of it, but I saw Lana do it, and it looked good. And they're getting dry. Oh, I need a haircut. That's what that's telling me. Okay. Make it tight as possible. Grab some more hair. I think I'm doing it. I think we're getting somewhere. See what people have to do for curls? Like, if this doesn't make you appreciate your curls, <laughs> I don't know what will. Look at me. Look at me. Well, in part, don't be messing things up. Let's put some more mousse. Maybe some cream. It's so dry. Do this while you have two hands. Ooh. Oh, no. I just poured way too much on the table. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm going to kind of go up so that it, I can fit it all on here. Oh, that's not going to be cute. <laughs> do not. Do not let it wrap like that. There we go. I'm gonna smooth it and wrap it. Okay, that seems kind of promising. Then you're supposed to grab the scrunchie and then hook it on the bottom so that it stays. Okay, everyone stay. All right, I think I did it. I think we did something. Let's try it again on this side and see if it does, if I do any better. Okay, I feel like that side went a lot smoother. Look at that, that looks pretty beautiful. I feel confident about this side. The first side, I don't know. Might be taking pictures from one side after this. Okay, look at me. I guess that's it. What's this headband for? The final look? I don't know what the headband is for. Is it to keep this flat? Is this part of it? That's not part of the instructions. Do it like this. Keep it from being frizzy. To sleep on it? I don't know. So at this point, you're supposed to just sleep in it overnight, wake up with beautiful curls. Uh, if you have straight hair, it might not take that long. But I am very impatient, and I kind of want to do this tonight. So I'm going to try to use my hooded dryer. If you saw the first video of me using this, you know that this looks hilarious. But I wonder if I could fit all of my head in here. And then we'll just, just dry it faster for those of us that are impatient. This is also from Amazon. Ooh, how do I get this in there? I put the whole head in there. I don't want to mess it up. I guess I can go like this. Bend you in there. See, isn't this so easy? <laughs> oh yeah, the little chin strap to really make it cute. Look at me. I don't know if the chin strap is necessary. <laughs> There we go. Now you need a blow dryer. I'm gonna have to use my Curlsmith one because it has a nice skinny nozzle to attach to this. Okay, so you get your blow dryer. Okay, here we go. This part always scares me. Three, two, one. That was anticlimactic. Plugging it in usually helps 99.9% of the time. Wait, wait, 
<laughs> Wait, we weren't ready. We weren't ready. <laughs> oh my goodness, it scared me. Okay, three, on my count. Three, two, one. Wait, let's do medium heat, high heat? Mmm, medium. I put it on high heat. Cause I ain't got all day. And then we just sit here for like 30 minutes. Hopefully. Whew. Okay. Oh, wow. Uh, I see, I don't know if my ears are supposed to be in or out. I'm looking like an elf. Uh, it's hot in here. <laughs> I end up putting on the cool shot every now and then just to like cool down my head. Um, took off the straps. It was just too high. Hair still feels wet. That was probably like 15 minutes. What if, let me make sure I'm not messing this up by bending them. Everyone still okay? Okay. I think it's getting there. Oh, it feels so good out here. My ears are on fire. I don't know if they're supposed to go in there. What if I just do one side at a time? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. You're supposed to stay tight. I need, like, another clip. It might be too late for you. Okay, we'll see. Putting this in here. Tightening it. Maybe not. I saw Lana try this as well. Let's do it. Oh, my ear! Okay, hold on. Oh, that's too hot. That's too hot on the ear. Keep my ear out. Let's do medium heat, high. Okay, it's been 12 minutes on this side. Let's see, we're getting there. I did realize that this Curl Smith diffuser is actually the perfect diffuser for this type of style because I forgot it has a little kickstand. So I could just set it on the table. And be hands free! Look at those happy little balloon guys. That's great. But I think I'm tired of this. Let's peek. I'm so impatient. I'm so impatient. Hmm. Not bad. But I don't think it's fully dry yet. A little bit longer. Okay, need the strap. Okay, I'm tired. <laughs> I don't want to do any more. I feel like it's dry enough. Let's just try it. Let's just take it out. Let's take out one side at a time and see what happens. Oh, okay, we got a little curl action going on here. Wait, how do they take it off? Oh, so she pulls it up. Okay, we take this out. Take off the extra clips that I added. Oh. Here we go. Oh, it feels wet in the middle. Wow, and that is how you become Queen Abidala. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, my hair is still wet. Oh, do I let it dry overnight? What's happening? I just let it shake out. I mean, it might have done something if it was. It's pretty wet. It's still wet. It's not okay. Do I put it back in? Oh no. Oh no. I mean, okay, this one's fully dry. I think that's what it's supposed to be. But honestly, since I have curls, there's just easier ways to get this look. Hmm. Well, I, I, actually, now that I look at it. <laughs> Do I keep going? Okay, let me let me add some oil to it. 
No, it's still wet. That's the problem. Okay, let me add some of my Rizos Curls. This is her new strength oil. I haven't tried it yet. The more I look at it, the more I'm not as mad. Okay, this is a new strength oil. It has lavender, flaxseed, moringa. Ooh. Oh, wow, it smells. Mmm, like a tea. It's gonna fix something. Slowly undo these. Oh, when you undo it, it makes it frizzier. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know how I feel. Do I dare blow dry it? Can I diffuse it? What do I, what do I do with this type of curl? I feel like it doesn't look good up close, but on camera from afar, from a very far, it looks different. It needed to dry more. Let me try to diffuse. Let's see what happens. Mm -mm. That ain't it. That ain't it. I can't tell if it's horrible or decent. The ends are really a problem. On camera, it doesn't look that bad. If you hide my ends, it's kind of like her vibes, but you know I love my curls. Okay, lessons learned. You gotta have patience, which is something I don't have. If I would've let it dry, it probably would've looked better. Right now, it kind of just looks stretched out and fluffy. Um, but it is, it looks, it looks okay. It looks okay right now. If you just don't look at it for too long. But if you have straight hair, this will definitely work a lot better for you. I think even for wavy hair. But if you have really tight curls like me, it's kind of hard to stretch them. I would say you have to make it even tighter than I did, wrap it tighter and let it sit longer. All things that I don't want to do. <laughs> but the hairstyle challenge is all about trying new things, challenging yourself. And this was my challenge of the day. It was even waiting as long as I did. And here we are. Oh. Okay. If you enjoyed watching me struggle through this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos every week. The holidays are coming, so I am going to be doing a lot of giveaways. I'm actually giving away half of my entire curly hair collection, maybe more. So I'll probably be doing lots of giveaways on Instagram Live. Maybe I'll do my first TikTok Live. But point is, you gotta be following me on Earthang. So make sure you are subscribed here on YouTube. Hit the little bell so you're notified. Oh. Okay, bell notification sound effect coming in at the perfect time. Also follow me on Instagram and TikTok at Ms. Bianca Renee. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today.